May 2nd, 2018. Proof of life. So it's 2018, what do you know? Leading up to an election. And it's nothing really to report in the news, right? You're reading the same thing. It's we're in a loop right now. We're in a in a uh, in a loop. The Democrats are doubling down on the fact that uh, that uh, Russia stole the election and that that they're going to sue and that Mueller's closing in on Trump and you know, and the, and the, the FBI is closing in on Clintons and all this bullshit, all this thing that has nothing to do with policy, has nothing to do with improving the lives of American people, right? It, yeah, corruption is bad news, man. It's bad news. We live in a in a in a cesspool of corruption, but we have to we have to get them out of office, right? That's what we have to do, right? got to get them out of office because they're not going to prosecute themselves and each other. If they do, it'd be very, you know, be all, be very surprised. But you stand there with your, with your fingers crossed, crossed, hoping that the oligarchy arrests themselves. See, they're all in on it. You got to, you got to, you got to put it into perspective. There is no separation between our political structure and the uh, the corporate elite right? it's the same they take the money they do the favors right so to have all these people to, to sit around holding your breath waiting for the Clintons to get caught it off caught it off the jail and Comey and McCabe and you know you know Mueller to find <laughs> Russia collusion it's just it's just pompous so anyway it's a hurry up and wait. Um, cycle right now we wait for the swell because all the all the all the, the uh, you know the activists come back during election time and in between they sleep right so that's all for now it's just a beautiful day in new york it's 80s 75 80 down on jones's farm nothing changes my name is marcus conti investigative journalist and candidate for the United States Senate. Peace out.